Welcome back to my Whittier TV, folks. It is Monday. It is 5.30 in the morning right now. And uh, you're probably wondering, why is this dude up so early right now? Well, I am uh, actually asking myself the same thing. But I do have an answer. Today is the day the burrito truck officially opens its doors here in Whittier, California. After months and months of renovations, the doors will open at 6 a.m., and I had to be here for this. I had to wake up with the time change and all to be here to have the first breakfast burrito served from the newly renovated burrito track here in Whittier, California. Now, uh, I reached out to them a few months ago and said, you know what? I would be honored to have the first burrito sold and uh, at the newly renovated place. And they agreed to it. They were all about it. I was super excited when I got the phone call. So uh, I'm here and I'm waiting for the doors to open. There's actually a few people in line waiting, but uh, I already called the order in. We have uh, a variety of different burritos coming. We're gonna film it and we're gonna actually talk to the owner of the burrito track as well. And we are gonna have a great time with that. So stick around, watch the whole video and uh, we're gonna have a great time this morning. All right, so stay tuned. My Whittier TV is sponsored by Scott Storage. Twenty nine ninety five moves you into any size unit. All right, guys. As you can see, there is a buzz happening. We got about five people in line already. It's about 5.50 in the morning right now. Uh, somebody else just pulled up as well. So they are coming out for the burrito track. Let me tell you, they have been waiting a long time for these burritos and today is the day. Okay guys, welcome to My Video TV. I am here with Mr. Pedro Vaca, the owner of the burrito track. Congratulations on the rent, the reopening of your restaurant. Everybody in Whittier has been waiting for you to open this restaurant, and I'm so glad it finally happened. Are you happy? Very happy. Yes. This is uh, one of uh, my goals and my way to say thanks to the community. The sponsorship for so many years, more than 40 years, Bobby. And... Uh, I feel like uh, I owe to my community, to my customers. It's uh, my way to say thanks. Facility, better equipment, but the recipes is still the same. The old recipes, same as this old man. I appreciate it, yes. And you know what, you guys are loved in the community and uh, everybody was waiting for you to reopen. Did you have a plan to, to renovate or was that something that just came about? I, I, uh, on the last uh, three or four years, I was, it was on my mind yeah. to renovate and do something, something comfortable, efficient on the service. Mm -hmm. And uh, for years, uh, I said this is my pride to say that we keep the score A for so many years and we still going to keep it. Yes, it, it, looks, it looks great in here. You guys did a really great job. And uh, just speaking for most of the people in Whittier that I've talked to, they love this restaurant. They have so many memories going back years and years and years. You said 40 years. So, I mean, generations and generations come here and enjoying your food. And it has been an awesome, awesome thing for the community. It's, uh, it's amazing the power of uh, technology, the media. Yeah, it's true. Yeah. Goes, it's no borders for that. This customers they go out of town to another states and they keep in touch with us. Yes, yes. And from Texas, uh, Oregon, you name it. When they come back to Whittier, they come, they come to here. Here, yeah. That, that makes me feel it's a fourth generation kids from all the, the school districts around, especially High, La Serna, and more the other schools around. Yes, that uh, they come and this is uh, this is not my burrito truck. Yes. It's yeah, it's the community's burrito the track, community. and we appreciate it. 
So I'm gonna have some great food. I have the first burritos ever at the new renovated burrito track. I wanna thank you for that. Thank you for your time, I know you're busy. And but, uh, congratulations, Gabby, you are you're a young man with a lot of energy. At the same time, you are doing a lot for the community. I thank you. I heard a lot about you, and congratulations, you are a young man. You give a lot to the community. I appreciate it. Information, okay? I'm going to follow in your footsteps. Enjoy, <laughs> <laughs> enjoy your... Uh, uh, oh, I'm going to. I got three burritos, folks. We're going to eat those right now. So. I, I have one condition for my customers to, to buy my burritos. If, uh, the, if they like it, they have to let me know. Oh, definitely. But if they don't like it, I ask them not to tell anybody. <laughs> <laughs> Good formula. <laughs> All right. Thank you. Enjoy it. Nice meeting you, buddy. Nice meeting you. Thank you very much. God bless you. Okay. There you have it, folks. That is the man behind the burrito track. And what an honor it was to have him take a few minutes and sit down and talk to us about the burrito track. Wow. Okay. So this is uh, amazing. We're gonna get into some burritos right now. We did a uh, burrito, a breakfast burrito video a while back. You guys saw that, and um, it did really well. A lot of you voted Burrito Track as the best breakfast burritos in town. Unfortunately, it wasn't open. The renovation was happening. We weren't able to get to that. So we are gonna hit three burritos right now and show you those and give you the 411 on how those taste. And uh, we will we'll see if it's still up to par. And uh, we're excited about that. So stay tuned for that. Let's get these burritos. Okay guys, now it is time to try the food. Now, um, this chorizo burrito here is the first ever burrito ordered uh, at the newly renovated burrito track right here. So we're gonna try this one first, just to make it official. And uh, you guys voted this burrito as one of your favorites in town. So I'm gonna try this to find out what is going on. We're gonna put some hot sauce on this bad boy and uh, take a bite. Really, really good. Very tasty. I can understand why this is one of your favorite burritos. I really miss the burrito track. I got three burritos. In our last breakfast burrito video, I told you something very profound. I said, if you have bad beans, you have a bad restaurant, right? We all know that. So I had to get a bean and cheese burrito to go with my other burritos here, just, just to make sure things are on the up and up with the beans here. So let me uh, dig into this and give you the 411 on the bean and cheese here at Burrito Track. Yup. I have the amazing bean and cheese burrito going. I got the chorizo burrito going, and I am going to hit this machaca burrito right here. Three burritos in one city. I waited too long for this place to open to just have one burrito. So here you go. That's the machaca. Dropping that right into your living room, folks. And. Uh, no, I'm gonna put. Uh, I'm not gonna put any salsa on this. I'm just gonna dive in with it to it, just like this. So here we go. Wow, that shredded beef is so on point. Very good. I got a little beans in here as well, but the uh, machaca burrito. Wow, this is special right here very very good flavors and uh, I'm trying to decide if I like this one over the uh, chorizo burrito but the machaca burrito with the shredded beef is on fire right now so so good okay man so I am not going to uh, subject you guys to my whole breakfast but I'm definitely going to make an attempt to try and finish these burritos 
and um, I am so happy that the burrito track in Whittier, California is open. I am uh, honored to have been able to sit down with Mr. Pedro Baca and uh, discuss his feelings about his restaurant, about the community of Whittier. And uh, this is the reason I do these type of videos. It is really, really awesome. And uh, it means a lot to be able to do this. So thank you guys for watching. Come down to the burrito track, 6 a.m. to 10 p.m. daily, and uh, enjoy some of this great food. Check out the new renovation. You guys are gonna love it. Okay, guys, I just finished my amazing breakfast at the newly renovated burrito track here in Whittier, California, and it was awesome. Got to talk with the uh, owner, Pedro Vaca, and he is the nicest dude you will ever meet. And he is all about the community. The food is on point. It is so good. And they didn't skip a beat. It is uh, delicious. Everything is on point. The service is a little slow right now just because everything's brand new. They're just opening up. So uh, it was a pleasure to come down here and have breakfast. I hope you guys will join me in the experience and come down here 6 a.m. to 10 p.m. daily. And uh, yeah, our beloved burrito track is open for business. So come on down and check it out. I will see you next time on my Whittier TV, folks. Thanks for joining me. We'll see you.